All right, uh, we should start. So uh, what, uh, what are we going to be talking about this week is evaluation, which is basically how do you know if the, if the search algorithm that you've built is, uh, is any good. So um, evaluation is kind of a funny subject. At some level, what I'm going to be talking about uh, isn't very specific to information retrieval. It, it, it applies to lots of other fields as well. Uh, you tend to often disregard it, uh, but it's actually a really, really uh, important topic because uh, if you can evaluate things properly, uh, this usually means that you can make the systems that you build better, a lot better. So um, Google is what it is today, not because, not because of a single brilliant algorithm that somebody wrote, uh, but, but because they have perfected the art of evaluating their systems on the fly and retuning them on the fly and making use uh, of the data that they collect from searchers to improve their algorithms incrementally. Uh, and it's kind of an amazing thing. Um, it's uh, when, uh, when you're building something, you're usually aiming for big improvements, but big improvements don't happen in established fields. It's really hard to improve something by a significant amount. Uh, a lot of the big improvements that you see today are the results of tiny incremental re improvements where people have been improving the same system year after year after year by 1%. And then eventually it adds up and you see, and you see really dramatic uh, differences. <clears throat> so evaluation is kind of important. And for search engines, it has a lot to do with the logs that they collect uh, from, from your search sessions. So you search for things, you click on results. All of that data is recorded uh, in different ways, whether you like it or not. All of the data is logged, and that data is used to, re to change the rankings later on, to change the algorithms that produce uh, these rankings. <clears throat> so uh, that's what we're going to talk about in these lectures. We're going to talk about the Cranfield paradigm, which is basically a way to do evaluation and information retrieval. And then we'll talk about uh, lots of different ways to measure accuracy um, in, uh, in IR. So, um,